Welcome to this powerful anointed prayer. Listen, we're about to go in to annihilate and assassinate the enemy. Are you ready? Let's go into the power of agreement. The Bible says that when two or more come together and pray in my name, I will answer that prayer. So let's go pray right now. As I am praying, I need you to pray and be in agreement with what I am saying. Let's go. Father God, I thank you right now for your child watching and listening to this video. I prophesy that your power and your strength will come upon them right now in the name of Jesus. I declare the decree that they will begin to put on the whole armor of God so that they will be able to stand strong against the wiles of the devil in his schemes. In the name of Jesus. I declare and decree right now that we're going to bind everything and loose everything right now that is causing us to fail, to give up in the name of Jesus. I rebuke every force of darkness right now that is on your child that's trying to stop them and put out their light and I bind their power to stand. With everything that they do, they're going to stand. They're going to begin to put on the breastplate of righteousness right now. And their feet will be covered with the preparation of the gospel. According to Ephesians 6 and 15. I declare in the creed right now that we are binding and we are loosing everything that has tried to stop and block you right now. In the name of Jesus. I declare and decree right now, whatsoever I bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. And whatsoever I loose on earth shall be loose in heaven, according to Matthew 18 and 18. In the name of Jesus, I prophesy that this is your new day and your hour of liberation and spiritual elevation. In the name of Jesus. I want you to begin to Lift up your voice even higher and begin to pray as I pray for you. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I give you the praise. I give you the honor. I give you all the glory for your child life in the name of Jesus. And I declare in the creek right now that everything, God, that have come to stop them, block them, to cause them to go astray, to lose your anointing, to be withheld from power. I bind it now in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we come thanking you right now for giving them their power back, giving them their rightful places back. I declare the decree right now that they're rising above their situation. They're rising above their problem, God. I'm grateful, God. I'm thankful, God, for their life on today, God. We honor you. We praise you. We, oh God, magnify your name on today right now. We love you, God. Oh God, and there is nothing that can separate us from the love of God. Father God, I just thank you, God. I thank you that you are our help in the time of trouble, God. And you are our deliverer from every adversary, from every devil, from every enemy, from every hater, from every soothsayer, from every vex, every plot, from every scheme, God. You are our deliverer. You will deliver them from all, oh God, all. I need you to shout all of my problems. Oh God, all of my troubles. God shall deliver me from them now in the name of Jesus. Father God, I come to you right now diligently seeking your face, God. Oh God, in total, for total vindication, for breakthrough, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, I declare the decree, swift deliverance. Oh God, in your child life, God, I come uh, to you, God, knowing God, according to Psalms 34 and 15, that your eyes are up on the righteous and your ears are open to our cry, God, in the name of Jesus. 
Hear my cry, O Lord, and deliver us from the hands of the enemy, God. According to Psalms 3 and 5, God, oh God, you are our shield, God. Oh God, you are our shield. Come on, tell God, you are my shield. Yes, God, cover your child. Oh God, surround about your shield. Around them now in the name of Jesus. That the enemy will not be able to penetrate them. Penetrate their homes. Penetrate their minds. Penetrate their families. He will not have no room to get in. In the name of Jesus. For you are their shield, God. Oh God, you are our glory God I declare and decree that your glory begin to rise up on them like no before and you are the lifter of our head God and God we thank you God we thank you for lifting up our heads God lift up your child head like no before God I pull them up out the pit I pull them out of that place of depression I pull them out of that place of despair now in the name of Jesus they're rising up even the more God they're rising up in their finances. Uh, they're rising up in their careers. Uh, they're rising up on their jobs. Uh, they're rising up in their spirit man. Uh, they're rising up in their prayer life. Uh, they're rising up in their worship. Uh, they're rising. They're rising up in their communities. Uh, they're rising up in their ministries. Uh, they're rising up in their gifts. Uh, they're rising up in their dream life. Uh, they're rising up in the prophetic. Uh, they're rising up, oh God, uh, in the apostolic. Uh, they're rising up to perform signs, wonders, and miracles. Huh? They're rising up with power in the name of Jesus. Huh? Raise them up now, God, huh? and lift up their head like no before. Huh? Your glory is coming over them even now. Huh? As they are listening to this prayer, God, huh? we thank you now, God. Huh? We magnify you now, God. Huh? We glorify you now, God. Huh? So, Father, we thank you, God. Huh? We thank you for your anointing, God. Huh? I thank you, God. I thank you huh? for delivering your anointing over your child now. Huh? For deliver your anointing, God. Uh, within their spirits now, God. Uh, thank you for anointing them, uh, anointing them now. Oh God, I thank you for delivering your power now. In the name of Jesus, God. Oh God, let them know, God. Send your angels to minister to them, God. Uphold them, carry them now. Oh God, let you, the, your angels uh, go on assignment for them now uh, to open doors. Oh uh, Baba, to shut down the forces of darkness now. In the name of Jesus, God. Uh, deliver your power to them now. Uh, through the blood of Jesus Christ, God. Uh, and I ask you, oh God, uh, that your angels fight with them huh? as we dis as I dis as I dethrone huh? and destroy the works of their opponents now and adversarial enemies now in the name of Jesus huh? I declare and decree that according to us Isaiah 54 and 17 huh? No weapon formed against them shall prosper. And that every tongue that rises against them in judgment, uh, using any form of seance, uh, chat, hack, ungodly creed, uh, or bond, uh, or negative spoken word, uh, and curse that it is already condemned uh, right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, they are condemned. Uh, we cast them, we cast them down now. In the name of Jesus, God. Oh, Lord, your word. Oh, Lord, your word. Oh, God, we thank you. Your word, Father, declares and Psalms 34 and 21 that the evil shall slay the wicked. They that hate the righteous shall be desolated. I cast and destroy the demonic plans, mold, uh, schism, schemes, and scams of the enemy now. And I resist, rebuke, and bind every diabolical false witness, false accusation, and evil injustice fought against their life in every court system, especially the unjust courts of darkness. In the name of Jesus, and I bring to know every wicked counsel and evil advice declaring that not one of them will prevail over your child. It will not prevail over us. In the name of Jesus, lift your voice now and tell the devil his schemes, 
plans, uh, his plots, uh, all his scams uh, will not prevail over my life. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, be begin to declare that you are blessed. Uh, I am blessed uh, and highly favored. Come on, say I am blessed uh, and highly favored. Uh, the Lord is on my side. Uh, and if God is for me, uh, who can be against me? Uh, I am not alone. Uh, I have angels uh, that are walking with me, upholding me. Uh, if I shall dash my feet up against the stone, uh, the angels will catch me. Uh, if I fail, uh, I am unstoppable. I am unmovable. I am unshakable. I am the head and not the tail. I am above and not beneath. I am a winner. I am more than a conqueror. In the name of Jesus, my family is blessed. My house is blessed. My health is blessed. My mind is blessed. My soul is blessed. Everything that I touch is blessed. Everyone that is connected to me is blessed. Everyone that encounters me shall be blessed. I am going higher in God. I am going deeper in God. Nothing shall shake my faith. I shall stand in my faith. In this world that is losing faith. If everything around me crashes, I will trust in the one and only God who created the world, who created me. For he shall not fail me. He shall be with me. I trust my God, the God of Jacob, the God of Moses, the God of Isaac, the God that parted the Red Sea, the God that performed miracles, the God that calls his children clothes, oh God, to not wear out their shoes, not wear out the God that sent ravens to feed Elijah. I serve a big God, the God that's bigger than my problem, the God that's bigger than my situation, the God that has not failed me yet, the God who's been with me in the beginning and should be with me in the end. Oh, I serve you, God. I worship you, God. I honor you, God. I praise you, God. You are my God. You are not just a mere statue, a mere idol that cannot talk, that somebody created. No, you are God that is alive, that has risen, that is alive in a well. You are a God that performs. You are a God that demonstrates. You are a God that talks. You are a God that understands. You are a God that answers by fire. You are a God that answers. Your people, you give solutions. When there's no hope, you bring hope. You are a God that never leave it us. Oh God, and I thank you now in the name of Jesus. Oh, Baba de Kiaranabai, begin to pray, begin to pray. Rotarande Kiarando Koranabai, as you pray in your heavenly language. If you don't have the gift of tongues, you better begin to ask God to give you the gift of tongues because whatever you desire, God will give it to you. If you don't desire it, you won't get it. But I declare the decree that if you don't speak in tongues, right now you're going to begin to speak in tongues under the unction of this prayer. There's going to be a heavy anointing that's going to overtake you. Even now to speak in tongues on a whole other level. If you already speak in tongues, your tongues is going to another level. I declare and decree that you're going to begin to have tongues, my God, that you never had before. Tongues of prayer, tongues of fire, tongues of warfare, tongues of worship, tongues of angels. Yes, tongues, 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 new tongues. Diaries of tongues. Tongues that perform miracles. Tongues, tongues. Right now, I birthed it out of you now and in you now. Go higher in your tongues. Go higher in your prayer language. It is a spiritual language that the devil don't understand. It is a spiritual language that God understands. Heaven understands. Begin to speak. As you speak, your spirit man is getting strengthened. As you speak, you're going higher in God. As you speak, 
speak things are being broken off of you as I am speaking I hear God saying your voice is going to another level things about you is changing your mindset is going to change after this things that used to bother you will not bother you any longer come on speak speak God is doing a new thing in you I hear God say I'm doing a new thing in you Yes, yes, I hear God saying, don't think it's strange that you're going to start soaring. You're going to start moving faster than what you ever moved before because yokes are being broken. The annihilation of the enemy have taken place as you watch this video, as you tuned in to listen. Things are taking place in the atmosphere and the spirit realm on your behalf. For there is anointing behind this video to give you the grace to keep going. When you wanted to give up, you didn't give up. Come on, push, push, push. You're being shot for higher. You're going higher, higher, higher. Higher in your prayer life. Higher in your worship. Higher in your study. Higher to understand the word. More revelations. New realms in God. God is going to begin to meet you and visit you at certain times. Have your pen and your paper out. To meet God. The sweet presence of God has showed up now. In the name of Jesus, you may feel the need to cry. Cry. Let the Holy Spirit overtake you. You may feel the need to go to the bathroom. There's a releasing that is taking place for every demon, every demonic force, every wish that puts something on you is being broken now. So release it. Release it. Release the cry. You may feel the need to yarn. Let it out. Let it out. Because these spirits can't stay on you. Out with the old and in with the new. In the name of Jesus, God is doing something new. Let him do it. There's something new that God is doing with you. I hear God say, the anointing behind this video is taking you to another level. Pray with it, uh, uh, pray with it daily. Uh, go to sleep with it, listening to it. Uh, for this anointing uh, will take you uh, to places that you never thought you would go. Uh, it's the anointing that destroys the yoke. Does not matter where you're listening, uh, for there is no distance in the spirit. Uh, it is the anointing in the spirit behind this video. Uh, that's why you feel fire. That's why you feel that cool breeze. Uh, Check your body. Check my God. Your, 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 your spirit man. Check the way you feel now. You came your way to down. But those spirits had to leave. Now you have rest in your spirit. You have joy. Don't let the enemy take it from you. I see you crying. God said keep crying. Because crying is a sign of deliverance. Yes, yawn it out. As you begin to yawn, I hear God stand out with the old and in with the new. As you're listening right now, working out, God is saying, I'm shifting some things. Every step you take, even as you work it out, I hear God saying, you're taking that step in the spirit. So don't take your work out lightly. Visualize each step you take. Every step that I take, that's a step to go higher in the spirit. Those of you that are working, you're listening, going through some things right now in your job. But I hear God saying, I'm working some things out in the workplace. Let me do my job. I'm working. I'm working some things out on your behalf. Let this video saturate you in the glory and the anointing of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Let everybody say amen. Amen. Hallelujah. And it is so and so shall it be. Follow, like, subscribe to this channel for more prayers and videos and teachings such as this to keep you going to go to another level. And feel free 
to go and support this ministry so that we can continue to do what God has called us to do. You need prayer. If you want to sow, text the word sow or prayer to 1844 Dr. Gwendolyn. All information also will be in my bio underneath the description of this video as well. Feel free to go to my website and check out some of our anointed oils and prayer cloths just for you to get you to another level in God. Listen, I love you. I just know that today is your day that you are not annihilated and be assassinated the enemy. Don't go back. He gonna come back to try to fight, but you won't always win. Listen, it's your time and it's your season. Make sure you comment down below and you enjoy this prayer and what type of prayer you would like me to pray next. If you want me to pray for marriages or you want me to pray for finances or you want me to pray for purpose or peace, whatever it is, comment down below. And then also let me know how did this prayer bless you? What happened when I was praying? What did you feel? Give me your testimony down below. Listen, I love you. I'm the woman from God, Dr. Gwendolyn B. Punyo, and I'm just here to shift you and take you on a whole other level in God. It's time to be empowered in God. Let's go. Kingdom tribe. I love you. Be encouraged. Until next time.